guys, this is Viron from Secret of the Stars and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a watercolor piece and it's gonna be a totally not fan art of a totally not familiar game to you. <laughs> oh my fooling. We are doing fan art for Fate Grand Order again. <laughs> and this for the current event that's running as of recording the video, which is with the Teta Suhai Kitan. And I wanted to roll for Okita's Logi Alter, or who I will be calling as Okitan. And I wanted the Catalyst, so that's what we're doing today. So before we actually get into the like, the more nitty gritty of the art, I wanted to ask how you guys are doing. It's currently June 14, so I'll be uploading this the moment I export it, but let me know how you guys are doing down in the comments. Here in the Philippines, just place it on a marker or as a marker. We are still under enhanced community quarantine, though a lot of the industries or a good number of industries have been put onto 50% capacity, which means 50% of the workforce are allowed to return. This is to supposedly help keep the economy not crash. <laughs> um, of course, it comes with concerns such as, you know, there are more people on the roads nowadays, so there could be a good chance of a higher rate of infection if people are not careful. There's also the, the issue of, you know, public transport, um, bills, debts to pay, all of that. But really, again, as I think I mentioned in a different video, this isn't the channel or the video to read talk about that in depth i mean it's over fan art like i should <laughs> it's it's it doesn't seem appropriate it should be in a separate video but let me know down below how you're doing if you're doing fine i mean i always hope that your family's doing okay i hope you're doing okay i know that this time or this period is pretty stressful mentally emotionally so i hope, I hope you have time and space to be able to recover Personally, I've been actually just recovered from being slightly sick. I mean, it wasn't a cold or anything, so it wasn't anything COVID uh, symptomatic. It was just a stomach thing. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, I was down for like a week, so I wasn't able to upload this video right away. And after that, something also happened, so I really didn't have much energy to do much. So I only started exercising again yesterday, and gosh, two weeks of not exercising. I didn't know it would be that bad. I feel like I'm worse than when I started exercising in general. Gosh. <laughs> so yeah, I was super weak yesterday after exercising. It could be also because I don't drink water a lot. Uh, in general, even before. My body tends to not require a lot of water, which is bad. Even though, I even though it's like that for me, I should drink water regularly. <laughs> Whether or not I'm able to do that is a different question. But yeah, I, I guess it's because I'm slightly dehydrated, maybe especially after exercising. So I have to be slightly careful about that. But I'm trying to exercise and get things going again. Um, I've been having that slight itch to be productive again. Like, I want to. I'm getting thoughts of going back to find the job already, um, or do something in that vein. It's not, you know, it's not nagging me yet, so I can hold out a little bit because I don't really want to go out when the virus is still out there. And yeah, I, I am having slight thoughts of wanting to work again. Which is not a bad thing, to be honest. I mean, that's kind of good. But, you know, when there's a pandem pandemic roaming around, that's not the best time for those kinds of thoughts. <laughs> but nonetheless, I know that's a very privileged way of seeing things because I have savings, I'm living with my family, so I'm privileged that I can chill out for like a up to three to four months without really having too much problems but for you who have to go back to work 
it might sound irritating to be honest but i hope you keep me safe nonetheless and i hope things will you know not normalize but get better soon enough so that things don't go to shit <laughs> i mean yeah anyway <laughs> so okay then <laughs> let's actually go back to the topic of the video so the concept that i had for this was that i wanted to show parts of the original okita Sloji saber um shown by the sakura petals and that's mainly because okita Sloji saber used the nickname sakura saber when she was in the Guda Guda comic as like her, you know, hidden name. So Sakuras are, Sakuras are very associated with her in general. Uh, so I wanted to show that when I wanted to show parts of her peeking through Okitan. And yeah, yeah, I, I, I like this drawing. I mean, it's not the most complicated or the best. But I really like that backwards looking pose a bit, even though I've done it several times already. We actually do like how the hair flows here. Some framing things can be improved, like her hand got cut off. So I wish that I was able to pull her hand in more to show her hand holding her sword. You know, stuff like that. Or more petals to show to the Okita saber side of her. But it's an okay drawing. I mean, it's not unusual for an artist to have a drawing where they like it, and it's okay, but it's not their, like, proudest or their best, and that's okay to have. I mean, that's normal. Not everything has to be a masterpiece, so this is one of them. <laughs> I really wanted Okita Soji author because I have Okita Soji Saber and I managed to pull for her during the first Guda Guda run. And if Arthur Pentagon prototype was not in the game, Okita Soji would have been my favorite saber. <laughs> and hands down, like she is she's the best. <laughs> I mean I'm not talking about gameplay, but like Okay, fine. Even character-wise, there are a lot of characters, a lot of people like different characters or different sabers, but she's goofy, she's fun. <laughs> she has tuberculosis, but hey, it's it's like a weird, funny part of her character that she wasn't able to get cured of it despite becoming a servant. You know, that kind of thing. And okay, so Soji Alter is Okita, so I wanted to get her. And I knew based on J the JP game two years ago that I saw a lot of people cry crying over Okitan, so I knew that I'll probably want her anyway, so I pulled for her, and I got her, thankfully. So she's my first Outer Ego Servant. Um, I don't really use much of the extra classes, uh, aside from Ruler, I guess. I use John a lot, but I'm really not that big on Cavalries and more so extra classes, so I'm pretty solid with the knight classes, so I have good sabers, I have good archers, I have good lancers. My cavalry isn't as stellar. I mean, I have Merlin, so I have a good support caster. But my assassin class and my rider class aren't super good. I mean, most servants or almost all servants are viable in the game, but you know, I don't have a super, super... 5 star amazing cavalry classes. I mean, I have Sanzo, I guess, and Asahabe. But Asahabe support. Anyway, so I guess when I say I'm not big on extra classes, day, I mean, I really don't use them. So my berserkers, despite having a lot of berserkers, um, don't get, really don't get used that much unless it's like a multi-class fight or it's something I want to wipe right away. Even then, I don't really use Berserkers that much. Uh, rulers. Rulers, I use Jean a lot. And I pulled for Amakosa specifically because, because of his debuff removal skill. Um, or his buff removal skill, rather, not, not debuff. Outer Egos, I have none. 
I wanted to get Notre this, but I think I was saving up for a different servant so that I, I didn't pull for her. Passion Lip, I didn't get. Kiara, I didn't get. So Okita Soji Alter, or Okitan, is my only alter ego. And she's probably gonna change the way that I use servants a bit now. Now, uh, I don't have any foreigners. Though, two years from now in the Rep PM event, Borrowing that there's a server that I really want from Summer 5. If I don't want anyone from Summer 5, I might pull for Voyager. But that's two years from now, so I won't have any foreigners until then. Uh, Moon Cancer, everyone has a BB right now. I don't plan on getting BB Summer anyway, so I'm sticking to normal BB. Um, Avenger, I have Hessian Lobo. And Angra Mainyu, I don't have John. Well, I, I know she's one of the best Avengers in the games, but uh, I, can, I can just borrow. Dantes, he's a quick type, which I don't mind. I actually don't super hate him. It's just that I don't really have any banners to pull him in, and I don't think I can fit him in, in my pulling schedule. So yeah, uh, aside from Octa Soji out there and John, Normal Jean Dark. I kind of don't use extra glasses. Anyway, I rambled a lot. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like the video. If you really enjoyed it, feel free to subscribe to my channel. I put out similar content right, semi regularly. <laughs> Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and DeviantArt, and I'll see you around.